Hey guys, I hope you're having a wonderful day and today we're going to be looking at the year 5 operators that are to come. Now with my previous video this is just kind of like a part 2 to the operator rework leaks. So this is from the same source and the same guy. Like I said in that video it's hard to tell if this is real or fake but the way it's worded makes me believe it is real and it also backs up previous leaks that we've got from other reliable people so I believe this is real. I will have the source in the description down below if you want to check it out for yourself and figure out if it is real or not but let's just take a look at what is here on the leak. So it says here the new secondary gadgets is a trip wire and a proximity mine. Now we already know that the proximity mine is coming to the game but it also says here a trip wire. Now I wonder how that's going to work. How will it differ from Capcan? How much damage will it do? Will it even like do any damage? Who knows but that is the secondary gadgets but the main topics of today's video is the operators. Now the year 5 season 1 attack or attacker is a free speed stealth drone faster and quieter than regular drones with increased jump distance echo lesion invisibility effect when drone is idle can toggle on an x-ray effect which takes it out of stealth mode to see through walls increase time to get on and off the drone for him so it seems like the attacker is going to be a male at the ends of saying him it will take longer to open up the tablet like the animation duration will be longer going on and off the phone to go on a drone which is uh, fair enough because you know it's a stealth drone you don't really want to be stealth droning they can't even see it you quickly hop off and then quickly pick around the corner but yeah it is a free speed which makes me happy I love free speed ops but yeah I don't really understand the x-ray effect bit which x-ray effect which takes out of stealth mode to see through walls i wonder how that's gonna work it can't just be wall hacks right that's a bit it was just gonna be another lion oh lord but that is the ability as of for the weapons we already know the weapons because the weapons have been leaked on the tts but it is the g36c the irx 200 the mk 1 9mm but this is a weapon we don't know it says the gsh 18 which is the secondary that glads and uh, like all the russians have but can you anyone let me know when you go on tts and open an alpha pack if you get a skin for the gsh does it come up with that little operator icon to say it's for the attacker because it's a bit weird that we've figured out all the weapons from that but it what like it's a coincidence that no one's got the skin for the gsh 18 it's a bit weird but moving on to the defender it is a, a one speed anchor but it says here a visual anchor three devices that can be spread out anywhere that grant invisibility to drones in the area of effect moving in the area at all shows the operator glitching like visual slash knock standing still grants both audio and visual deception so that is gonna be quite good so think of like a mute jammer you place it down but when you're within that area of effect it's kind of like you have the visual ability on but it's only within that mute jammer range so that's going to be really good for anchors just to also support the other anchors yeah that's going to be really good standing still grants both audio and visual deception so it seems like if you're standing still you go fully invisible on drones and then if you're moving around and then it will be like the operator glitching that's what it sounds like anyway but that is the defender it looks like we've got a free speed attacker and then an anchor for defense as for the weapons we've got the mp5 pdw9 the spaz 12 the bailiff and a usb 40 which we already knew from the previous leaks which is also another reason why it makes me believe this the only thing that's a bit sketchy is a gsh for attack and no one's managed to figure that out like has no one got a skin for that on the tts who knows it says here the source inside guy who works for marketing slash communications for ubisoft but i've tried to contact him but you know i mean if he is legit and then he's probably not gonna apply but who knows let me know what do you think of this leak i think it's i don't know i'm kind of 50 50 on it the operator rework sounds legit the defender sounds legit the only thing the attacker sounds a bit weird but yeah let me know what do you think of these leaks even if it isn't if, if it never comes true i hope this is something they eventually make to come true but according to leaks these will be the year five season ones so who knows what's going to happen with the health drone leaks 
Apparently, an operator is going to have a health drone. Someone else will be able to sprint through softballs. But according to this leak, it's completely different. But then again, with the health drone and um, running through balls, we didn't have a lot of information on that. But yeah, these are the leaks. I feel like I'm just rambling on. Yeah, let me know what do you think. And that's pretty much it. So I hope you all have a wonderful day and goodbye.